Alright guys, so welcome back to Gamer Today! Today we're going to be talking about how you guys can get Venom skin as well as Venom's mythic ability within the game of Fortnite! Guys, this is insane! His ability is so overpowered and so fun, it's obviously something you need to try. Now guys, normally I hate the mythic abilities within Fortnite, but this one is totally cool! It helps you break down builds really fast! I know Wolverine's ability does that as well, but this is so cool! And if you're good enough with it, you can shoot through many walls and actually grab a player, pull them to you and shoot them in the head with a shotgun real fast! Now I'm not that good with the shotgun like that, so I couldn't do it! But but I can tell you guys that I've seen so many YouTubers doing it, it's awesome! Anyways guys, let's get into this. So where can we actually find this mythic ability? Well, you guys know those ships when you come into the game of Fortnite. Some of you guys might not even know, they're not just decoration. Even I thought for a while they were just decoration, but no, they actually land on the map of Fortnite and they have treasures. Yes, good treasures sometimes. You might get Groot's ability, which is a ball, okay? It's a ball. Have a ball with it, would you? It's not that great. Anyways, let's get into this. So, you can actually find Venom's mythic ability at these drop ships. They're called drop ships and there's two of them at any given time on the map of Fortnite. At least currently in the game, there used to be three to five dropships, but I think that's too overwhelming with all these different mythic abilities. It would probably ruin the entire game of Fortnite. So they've dropped down only to two of them, which makes sense, right? Anyways, guys, once you do get to these dropship carriers, you might notice there's the robots. Yes, we all know about the tech robots. Of course, Tony Stark's robots. You know what I'm talking about. You might want to take them out. You don't have to, but it's probably the easiest way to do it. Now, guys, I recommend not going directly to these dropships and landing there. You see a lot of people do it. There's always going to be two players every game that go to these drop ships. Now there's two of them, so guaranteed everyone's going to be swarming on them. Don't do it. Go to somewhere nearby that you know you can get at least an AR or a shotgun, something, well, hopefully an AR or an SMG. Make sure to sneak up on them, take them out, and then get your loot. Don't worry about it if they get the loot from the drop ship, etc. It doesn't have anything good, guys. Everyone goes to these drop ships and goes for the big chest in the middle. Don't waste your time. Yeah, that's great. If you're going to land there, that's the idea. You might want to go in there and get that loot, and then go and take out the robots. It makes sense. Well, that's not why you're here, guys. You're here to get Venom's mythic ability. You want that superpower, right? Those dropships never spawn that within the chest. They will never spawn a mythic ability, so you're wasting your time. Just go get some weapons outside of basically wherever the dropship is, some random location nearby. Get your gun and basically take out the enemy players that are there. It's so easy. They'll take out most of the robots for you, so you should have no problem. Now, guys, let's talk about something. There's only two dropships on the island of Fortnite at one time, right? Even if there's three, five, etc., you get the idea. But his ability will only spawn one time in these dropships between every game. That means no two players can have the same ability. That means you'll never see someone else with the Venom ability. You'll never have two Venoms fighting each other at one time. Unless they're wearing the skin, which is coming out very shortly. Let's get into that though, guys. The Venom skin. How cool is this Venom skin? I know I've talked about it before the cup came out, etc. You might have seen that video. But guys, this skin is totally bonkers. Now, I thought this skin was going to actually look a lot more like this pickaxe I put on screen right now. The scythe pickaxe. I can't remember what it was called. But guys, this pickaxe is what I totally envisioned that basically Venom would look like. And it came out in Chapter 2, Season 1. Maybe it was a prequel to what they plan to do this season. Who knows? Maybe they were testing it out and they're like, maybe Venom should look like this. I don't know. Now, obviously, guys, if you're watching this video right at release, you know that Venom's not yet in the item shop. So, yeah, it kind of sucks for us. But, guys, he'll be in the shop very shortly. And I'm totally pumped to pick him up. Some of you guys are basically played that cup and got the win. You guys already got the skin. How lucky are you? Let me know in the comment section if you got it. I'm totally excited for you guys. Now, Venom has always been a pretty cool character, guys. He's funny and he's just entertaining. That's what I like about Venom. I'm not into Marvel heroes or superheroes in DC universe all that garbage that you guys are, I just like Venom, he's a pretty cool character. He's like a villain to the Spider-Man universe and a couple other universes, but he's just so interesting and he's got his own thing going on. Now guys, if you might have seen him in the movies like Spider-Man 3 with Tobey Maguire, yeah, that was an okay movie, but Venom's inclusion was cool. Now of course they didn't really do well with the character, but yeah, they were still cool. Then of course he's got his own movie too, recently that came out a couple years ago, that was pretty good. Now obviously it wasn't a great movie by any means, and it, I really don't even understand how it fits into the storyline, but overall it's just cool cool to see Venom get some love, and obviously he's better than Deadpool in every way. Deadpool is just basically Bugs Bunny on crack, and obviously mixed a little bit with Mickey Mouse, and I don't like him. I think he's very boring. A lot of you guys love Deadpool, but not for me, guys. I really like Venom. His approach is just more funny to me, and that's why I like him. Guys, hopefully you did enjoy the video, and if you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know in the comment section down below, did this video help you, and if it did, let me know. I'm curious. Anyways, guys, until next time, it's been Gamer Today.